I'm about to give you the secret on how you choose a man. Seriously, no, no joke. This is the best way how to choose a man. Because the ways that you have done before ain't working. Many ways don't work. These are the modern ways that it's not really necessary. We are using things that's not working, tools that ain't working. So this is the way how it works. To choose a man correctly, close your eyes. Close your damn eyes and feel the vibration of who is talking to you. Feel the vibration. Because I think some of you all, some of us are so distracted, easily distracted about the appearance that you miss the whole point of relationship. We are so distracted by how a man looks, his height, his pee pee size and everything else that we are choosing wrong and we end up, we are ending up in situations where you are hurt, you are bitter, you are miserable, you are angry, you are insecure, it ain't worth it. The best way to choose a partner is to close your eyes and feel. See who is talking to you. Feel it in your body, in your spirit. Don't be driven by the appearance. You know, one thing I noticed about appearance, appearance, well, that's one of the biggest traps. Ain't it though? It's one of the biggest traps that we keep doing. All them people, you know, and today, let me tell you this. So many folks have so many options that nobody wants to sit still until they get to know somebody. You, you know, we quick to find somebody's flaws, don't, don't we? We quick to find what we don't like about somebody, but we can't find the things that we enjoy. We can't find a common ground. We can't find what we actually like because all we are, we are so scared and so insecure and so fearful that it might not work, that they might be lying, that it might be too good to be. We are so afraid of getting hurt that we don't want to give people the opportunity or the chance to even give you some time. Close your eyes. Feel them out. See how your energy feels. See how your energy digests theirs. See how your intuition is speaking to you. Close your eyes. And sometimes you got to close your ears because all the questions that you're asking, it ain't working. I don't care how they answer your questions. Some people have practices in answering questions. They know how to answer questions forever because they are you. See like somebody who keep going on job interviews? They know exactly what to say. They know exactly what questions are going to ask. And they know exactly how to answer. And based on their answer, it sounds good to the, per um, the persons who are asking the questions. But I'm telling you straight up, they could be, end up being terrible workers, terrible employees. Same like, a, you know, these relationships on dating, asking a hundred questions and everything sounds good. So, you friends with your mom? Check. Um, so, um, are you close to your family? Check. You take care of your kids? Oh, yeah. Check. Um, where do you see yourself in the next couple of years with us? Well, you know, they know how to answer all those questions. Say the first time, they spend their time on social media hearing these stupid things asked. And so you're not listening with your intuition. You're not listening with your discernment. You are listening with the logical answers that you hear that sounds good. You are listening with your emotions and your feelings. And when you listen with your emotions, you only hear about your desires. That's all you listen to is what you desire. Close your eyes and close your ears and feel people out. Feel people's energy. This is how you pick up a person. When two energies collide, there will be a shift in the frequency, there will be a shift in your vibration. When two energies or two objects come together, either you are, your energy is increased or is decreased. And that's what you focus on. And I think many times you don't know when your energy is, is decreased because you don't, you carry a low vibration in the first place. So most of the times it's decreased anyways. So I'm saying you gotta pay attention to how they feel in your spirit, to how they feel in your mind, to how they feel in your soul. Close your eyes, close your ears, and pay attention. Open up your spirit, because that's the only way you will know. So I'm, because I'm just saying, man, that's how you choose.